Hey, New York City. This is Kilfin from Africa. And, and you're, you're watching, watching Army of One TV. TV. My name is Giuseppe Sprana. Hi, uh, my name is Alessandra. Hi, my name is Raskevo. Uh, Skin Flint uh, was a band that was formed in Botswana uh, in Gavrone in 2006. And so far we've been together for about 12 years now. And uh, we played a couple, a lot of shows together. And this is our first time in the US. The idea behind Skin Flint was to mix elements from African culture with heavy metal. Uh, growing up in Botswana, we were exposed to many different kinds of music uh, such as Barankana which is our traditional music there and we also toured with other African artists that played Kwasa Kwasa and other genres of music and uh, the mythology and the storytelling is a strong aspect of African culture and we wanted to combine that with heavy metal. Um, we take a lot of our inspiration from our environment so we are from Botswana which is towards the south of Africa um, bordering with South Africa and yeah our environment really is an inspiration for us because we live like in the bush in the middle of nowhere so African storytelling has become the main theme behind uh, our lyrics and our musical style. Apart from uh, our culture uh, influences we also have uh, the international bands that have been influencing us uh, like the likes of uh, Black Sabbath for our guitarist DM and then Iron Maiden for me as well as uh, the guitarist and then we also have Black Sabbath for, for all of us. Uh, uh, Sandra was also listening to punk. So we also have some international influences and then this also led to a, a collective effort when it comes to uh, the, the, the writing of the songs. So we have uh, different um, streams where, where we can uh, draw some inspiration. We're currently in the US because we are going on tour with Soulfly. Uh, as a support band on their ritual tour. So our first show will be on the 19th of this month of February in Colorado Springs. And we will be traveling through uh, to Washington State, to Oregon, to California. Uh, yeah, California will be our last gig. We're really looking forward to this tour as we've been around for 10, 11 years. Uh, playing in the US has always been a dream for us and uh, to see it finally coming true uh, is really a, a surreal uh, experience. And uh, we're also happy to be touring with Soulfly because Max Cavalera, who also played for Sepultura, has combined elements from Brazilian culture with uh, heavy metal and I think it's a good fit for, for us and we really look forward to playing to fans in the US for the first time. I also think that it's, it's an important thing for bands to cross borders and play out of their country because when you play in one country or you play in one place for too long, you sort of get comfortable to that. So you will have a fan base in your own hometown and uh, people will respond, they'll go crazy for you. But playing in another country is always a challenging experience, especially when you play in another continent because people might not be familiar with your music or your songs or your style. So I think that really challenges the band to go out there and to play to new audiences and to try and make an impact there. We've recently released our fifth studio album and we recorded it at home in Botswana. So we're quite proud of the production because it was born and bred in our local country. Um, you can find it at our website, skinflintmetal.com. You can find it on Amazon, on iTunes. What I'm mostly proud about on the new album is that it's an album that is not overproduced. We just got into the studio and uh, it captures the raw essence of a band playing live in the studio. There are no studio tricks in it, we didn't want to use uh, any effects, and, but for some people they prefer it to sound more perfect, but with us, uh, with this new album, honesty and sincerity was the aim here. So we wanted the sound to sound honest, like you're in the same room as a band, and I think that, that is a good thing because when people see us live, it sort of sounds like the album and that's something that's important to us. We don't want to lie, we don't want to sound fake, it must sound real. Yeah. Our website is skinflintmetal.com, uh, there you can find all information about our tours, uh, our latest releases and any other news on the band. We'd really love to meet um, you guys out on tour, so you know, come to, come to the shows and bring a friend. It's going to be an experience that will shock you and surprise you, but I think 
it'll be definitely worthwhile. Uh, our fans can also join us on uh, Facebook. Uh, it's just Skin Flint page. And then we are also on Instagram, we're also on Twitter. So we'd like our fans to, to, to follow us there. You can get more information about what we are doing and what we'll be doing after the tour. This is an opportunity for us to play to fans in the U.S. for the first time and also an opportunity for our fans in the U.S. to see us live because we come from so far, we come all the way from Botswana, Africa. This is something different for us and I think it will also be different for audiences. So we look forward to seeing you and come say hi after the show.